Hey everyone! Uh, apart from my working on my automatic robot uh, answer to our client, uh, I want to share with you some video. Uh, something that many of my clients who sell apps or uh, buy from me apps or something else uh, have some issue. I want to show you like step by step what you, how you can share your app uh, with somebody else's account, not to share, to transfer, sorry. A uh, very easy process. Okay, so first of all, uh, if you're in this article, you see the video. Anyway, I have link for this article. You can click here. It's go Google and it's make work for you. Cool. How transfer up to Google Play account? And it show me to Google to this first page. We don't need to talk too much. You go to submit your transfer request. Okay, step number six. And it's what you need to provide uh, to transfer up. So we go submit your request. Something very, very, very critical. All this time you need to be logged in from your email. Okay, all this time you need to be logged in from your email. I mean your e email of your app. So I'm going to put, make it here. Okay, I write you here. Be login from the email. I'm going to. Because this uh, browser has my email, I go to the request. Anton Edelman, it's already on my account. Uh, if you make it directly when you connect it to your Gmail, so it automatically show your name, and it's okay. Now, developer name of target account. Basically, you need to ask your client to send you developer name from your target account. Is the developer name, for example, is developer name. Okay, very simple. Uh, next step. So, the, the uh, developer name from the target account. Target account email address. It's simply the email of the Google Play with uh, your Gmail register. And the next step is a little complicated, most people don't find it. Transaction ID from target account. So I will go here. So we have developer name of target account, original, original account email, it's your email. Transaction ID from original account, transaction ID from uh, target account. So it's the same basically. Uh, only you will need to find it in your plan to find it. You click here and it shows you to your payments. Now you go to subscription and services, I think. Yes. And you go to order pursue activity. If you don't buy nothing with Google, it's the only thing you will get. Google Play, $25. And it is your transaction ID. Okay, it's what you need to copy paste. So you would copy paste your transaction ID. Uh, of the original account and your client send you and you copy paste his transaction ID target account email your client who you send him the app and the packages packages it's simply a Taiwan upper line okay so if you have few apps you basically make enter so is the package app it is always after the after here okay so it's most people not make it like this. I want to show you how most of the apps make it. <laughs> it looks like this com dot. Okay. Most of them start, start with old, but anyway, after ID equal, this is what you take, it's what you put. And that's all you submit. And basically you finish the process. Very simple and not take too much time. You get email like something like this from Google, but Google uh, uh, get your app and you transfer. This can take between one hour to two, three days. Okay, something is very fast. 
A Google answer me can transfer it because of subscription in a purchase. If you in a purchase in the app, you can't transfer the app, nothing will help you, you can't sell your app. Do I need to update also my ad IDs in the app after transfer? Yes, it's not have any connection. If you need help, you can connect here and I can connect to my team for help. I still understand how to find the transaction ID. I show it now, so you understand how to do it. <laughs> okay, you can message me and my team uh, for help. It's you go to automatically to our bot. He try to help you. If he can can help you, we'll back to you. Don't worry. And that's it. Cool. Enjoy and uh, lot of sales. Bye bye, guys.